thought I'd make a cleaning video about this T7 uh, tenant scrubber. Uh, if you're getting streaking or poor pickup, it's probably because this side curtain is looking like this. This needs to be cleaned about every time. Now look uh, from the back. It's a little flared out because I had a problem with the motor. Towards the front, and you see how there's a tapered edge on it. That's because this unit right here isn't getting cleaned and is stuck. See, mine's all stuck up. This needs to float. So after you're done, pull this cap back. See how this moves up and down as the head moves up and down, or should. Get in here and clean this off. Just spray some water on this. And make sure that this arm is moving up and down slowly. I gotta take this off and clean it all up. But that should be a daily thing, is cleaning this squeegee edge. This sw swings way out so you can service it. And then this arm on both sides has to float up and down. Otherwise it's gonna be pressed to the floor and you're gonna wear these out and these are really expensive. Or it's gonna be stuck up and you're not gonna get the cleaning uh, sweeping to the middle of the water that you need. That's what this thing does. It catches the water, funnels it to the back, and so it can be picked up by the rear squeegee. So if you're leaving water out to the side, or this is squeaking a lot when you turn the corner, or if it's wearing out like this, probably this block needs to be cleaned so it can just float up and down. Mine's stuck solid. But this should just free float up and down as this head glides across the floor. This has to go up and down also. Needs to be cleaned every, every time you use it. Pretty much just... Swing this out, spray a bunch of water in there, and make sure that that thing's moving freely. Both sides. 